welcome guys and welcome back to my channel and this is Detroit become human and uh, the reason I want to share this with you guys is because it's really an awesome game I haven't been able to finish it because originally I played this game on my desktop and my desktop doesn't meet the minimum specs game so unfortunately it was glitching a lot there was uh, the last chapter that I played didn't want to start up which was chapter 8 so I decided to move it over to the laptop, which does meet the minimum requirement. Um, to give you an idea, the game was set on low graphics on the desktop and it didn't work. The laptop automatically decided to set it to medium. medium. And if you want to play that ultra high, you need at least a 1080 or a 20 series and up graphics card. But I'm happy with the medium. As you guys can see, the graphics looks really good. And uh, you'll see it's it's awesome looking now what this game is about is think of um, Ghost in a Shell combined with Blade Runner I don't know if I mentioned this but uh, I like your interior decorating it really reflects your personality I mean I like it well thank you very much so anyway you're gonna notice these three stories that's gonna it eventually become one big story three different lives three different androids and you're gonna see how they're gonna become self-aware and the decisions that you make is going to impact the game now in this game you don't make one decision you can make up to five different decisions and it's going to have an impact on everything that you do sometimes they give you only like a few seconds to make a decision which can be really a pain in the ass because sometimes they put you in a situation where you don't know what you want to do immediately you don't have time to think but let's get into this and let me introduce you to Connor hi guys subscribe to my channel now so that you do not forget hit that bell icon and get notified of my further uploads lastly feel free to comment show me some love by giving me a thumbs up at the end of the video August 15th, 2038 at 8.29 p.m. I can just imagine how this game would look ultra high with ray tracing and so on. I mean this is medium graphics. So let's begin right at the beginning. You can change your camera view. You can investigate the area and see what there is to investigate. The yellow markers are the points of interest. Sorry about my nose. So you've got Caroline, John and Emma Phillips. That's a photo of the family. fish and you can make your first choice here you can either decide to leave the fish to die or you can save it I'm not an asshole and I like fish swim Nima swim okay I actually like this tree this looks so freaking nice oh, please please you gotta save my little girl wait an android? All right, ma'am. You, you need to go. You can't do that. You. Why aren't you sending a real person? Okay, hold. Consult your objective. Find Captain Allen. So let's go and find Captain Allen. Five men are ready to step in. Just give the order. Fuck. Captain Allen, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's 
firing at everything that moves. It already shot down two of my men. I could easily get it, but they're on the edge of the balcony. If it falls, she falls. Do you know its name? I haven't got a clue. Does it matter? I need information to determine the best approach. Have you tried its deactivation codes? The first thing we tried. Listen, saving that kid is all that matters. So either you deal with this fucking android now, or I'll take care of it. 48% probability of success. Let's see if we can get the probability up. So, here's some points of interest. Let's start investigating. Three five five ammunition. A black hawk. What I love about the reconstruction is you can actually see what happened. And you can also follow extra clues. To the living room next. First, let's go to the girls' bedroom. Nothing in the bathroom. is going up at least. Okay, look at the hostage. There's another um, road or path that's been locked to us. That's not unlocked yet. Okay, let's start from this end. Three five five bullet wound, but hot ventricle perforated, internal bleeding. 
gunshot residue, which suggests that it did shoot at the android. And it's definitely dead. Okay, so the deviant was shot. Hostage witnessed the shooting. And there's the gun. Now I can pick up the gun if I want to, but I won't need it. Fresh blue blood. <laughs> In Hazmat they tell you, never taste anything. Don't be a fool. Tung the pitch. The reason why I didn't take the gun, I don't want to provoke him more. It can just cause a problem. Okay, 355 bullet wound, lower lung hemorrhage, internal bleeding. Ah, come on, you fucking asshole. Left kidney perforated, fatal abdominal trauma. Upper lung hemorrhage, pneumothorax. So this guy's pretty fucked. And John Phillips deceased. So now at least we know why David became a bit pissed off. Connor, how do you know my name? I know a lot of things about you. 
I've come to get you out of this! I know you're angry, Daniel. But you need to trust me and let me help you. I don't want your help! Nobody can help me! All I want is for all this to stop! I... I just want all this to stop! He's losing blood. If we don't get him to a hospital, he's going to die. All humans die eventually. What does it matter if this one dies now? I'm going to apply a tourniquet! Don't touch him! Touch him and I kill you! You can't kill me. I'm not alive. Place you and you became upset. That's what happened, right? They thought I was part of the family. They thought I mattered. But I was just their toy. Something to throw away when you're done with. I know you and Emma were very close. You think she betrayed you, but she's done nothing wrong. She lied to me! I thought she loved me. But I was wrong. She's just like all the other humans. Daniel, no! Listen. I know it's not your fault. These emotions you're feeling are just errors in your software. No. It's not my fault. I never wanted this. I love them. You know? But I was nothing to them! Just a slave to be ordered around! I can't stand that noise anymore! And tell that helicopter to get out of here! The situation is under control! There! I did what you wanted! You have to trust me, Daniel. Let the hostage go and I promise you, everything will be fine. I want everyone to leave! And I want a car. When I'm outside the city, I'll let her go. That's impossible, Daniel. Let the girl go and I promise you won't be hurt. I don't want to die. We're not going to die, we're just going to talk. Nothing will happen to you, you have my word. Okay. I trust you. I thought machines can't lie. Okay guys, <clears throat> up to this point, I hope you enjoyed the introduction to this game. That was Connor's introduction. And if you guys want to see more of this game, then please stick around. Remember to subscribe to this channel. Hit that bell icon so that you can get notified when I upload the next chapter. And give me a like if you enjoyed this, this, this first introduction video. And um, what I will do for you guys, if you give me likes, is I will even add... The extras, the behind the scenes, how they made this game, who the characters are and so on. I will add that 
to the game for you. And if you continue watching this game, you will notice, uh, you'll actually recognize two very famous actors in this game. So um, I hope you enjoyed it up to this point, and uh, I'll see you then on the next one. Cheers.